Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is Acceptance, and it's brought to me today, sponsored to me today, and proudly supplied to me today by the amazing people at Radlicky Games, RadlickyGames.com. Without them, guys, without them sponsoring this stream, this stream wouldn't happen. So big shout out to Radlicky Games. Much appreciated for sending me this game. Okay, if you're watching me live right now on my Twitch channel, well, I've been, off, I've been away for two days. Why? Well, why not? Nah. I had a bit of problems with my uh, Twitch channel. I contacted the good people at Twitch and I had to, um, I couldn't, my my VOD, so every time I stream, my videos, some of them randomly wouldn't save to my Twitch channel, even though they don't last forever. They last about 60 days on there. Um, it's required for some of my sponsors to have my streams saved to my VOD and some of them weren't saving. So I had to contact the good people, the good, the great people at Twitch. And they, they basically shut down my channel for two days why they had to reset things and fix it. So everything's hopefully working now. Hopefully all my videos will be perfectly saved. Um, <clears throat> pardon me, guys. Um, if you're watching me live right now on my Twitch channel, I want to say thank you for calling past and um, taking your time out to watch me playing this new game called Acceptance. But if you couldn't make it today's stream and you're watching me back on my YouTube channel, then thank you for watching. How are you doing? Hope you're doing well. How's your dog doing? If you haven't got a dog, how's your cat? If you've got a cat, or if you've got any kind of pets, how are they doing? Guys, it's never necessary. It's never asked for. Hey, if I was in your shoes, I probably wouldn't do it either. Yeah, seriously, I wouldn't do it either. But if for some crazy reason you want to like my videos, follow me on Twitter or Twitch, subscribe to any of my channels, uh, anything like that, I really, really do appreciate it. I want to thank you in advance because I won't get to thank you otherwise. Unless you want to comment and say, I subscribe to your YouTube channel and I like your videos, then I'll say, I'll reply back saying, thank you. Direct message, direct to you. But if not, I want to thank you to all you people out there. Okay, let me tell you what this game is about. That's enough of me rambling on. No one really gives a crap anyway. Um, let me tell you what this game's about, guys. Where are we? Acceptance. Once again, brought to me today by the amazing people at Runlicker Games. Runlickergames.com. Check them out. A horror game about losing someone you love. A story-driven psychological thriller about horrific consequences of a loved one's suicide. After the tragic tragedy of his wife's suicide, an office worker must proceed process his horrific events surrounding the incident. Oh, this game sounds terrible. Experiencing haunting char characteristics of five stages of grief. Denial. Anger. Bargaining. I don't know what bargaining has got to do with it. Depression and finally acceptance. In this as atmospheric 2D psychological thriller. What's bargaining got to do with it? The story focuses on the social issue of suicide and explores relationships with people who are at risk. Oh, this could be a this could be a dark game. Um, for those who are out there who are experiencing any uh, depression and stuff like that, um, get yourself some help, guys. Don't be afraid to talk to people. It's the best cure, or not cure, but best best way of getting on with life, I guess. I have no idea what I'm actually talking about, but you're not alone. You're not alone, guys. If you ever want us to talk to me about anything, hey, just start up a message with me. Anything like that, I'm happy to talk to you. Uh, this game features story-driven psychological thriller, focus on suicide and people at risk, immersive story and detailed characters, original graphics and soundtrack. Okay, so this um, this game's available right now, so you can go and it's just been released actually. It just got released a couple of days ago, so you can go and get it. Um, it's a single-player game. Support language in English, Spanish, French, German, and Russian. Russell Mano is the developer. It's available for the Nintendo Switch, the PS4, the PS5, Xbox One, Xbox Series S and X. Today, guys, I am playing in the Xbox Series X using an Xbox wireless headset and a design-led Redfall controller, which I've been using for quite some time now. I really got to change it up. Okay. Have a look at the credits real quick. Acceptance, game, art, music, Russell Mano. Special thanks to Salva Gris and Sasha Spent. If I pronounce your names wrong, I apologize. I'm doing my best. Settings, let's look at settings. Okay, volume is two or three. That's okay. And new game, because we've never played this game at all. Here we go, guys. I'll be quiet just in case there's a couple of voiceovers.
Oh, my eyes. Welcome to the stream, Jericho. Welcome, 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 buddy. I hope you're doing well. Okay. Are you ready to face a new day, Adam? No, you're not, fucker. But you don't have a choice. You have to go to the office. I watched the game. Oh, it was game already. Emily, baby. Hey. Hello, my dear. Sorry, I'm late, as always. Too bad. Come back soon. I miss you. Sure, I'll try not to be too long. Love you. Okay, their eyes are freaking me out. <laughs> I thought his eyes were bad till I saw hers. Oh, I like how this game looks. I like how it plays out and everything. It's awesome. It's giving me uh, goof goosebumps already. I don't know why. Maybe it's cold. That's why. <coughs> Ah, well, at least there was nothing out of the ordinary this morning. No sad faces, no hysterics, no strange words. I hate to admit it, but sometimes I'm sick of these mood swings. And that fucking job. I like to bury myself in the ground and stay there for the rest of my life. My control is vibrating like there's no tomorrow right now. Ah, it stopped. Okay, so we, we can walk now. Okay, let me... Yeti Marketing. Yeah, straight off the back, guys. Let's have a look at the visualizations of the game. It's crisp. It's nice and crisp. I like how it looks. He's, he needs to have a shave, or he's got that 5 o'clock shadow going on. He's just depressed, though. He's just he's just over life. You can just see how the way it looks. Soundtrack-wise, not much soundtrack. Atmospheric soundtrack. Bit of a... Little bit of a jingle in the background. It's nice. It's, it's crisp. It's... it's Really 3D-ish on my headphones. I like it. Um, well, controller-wise, it's easy at the moment because I'm just moving across. Ah, oh, the black cat. Actually, it looks like it doesn't look like a cat. Actually, it's the size of a cat, but it's kind of like that, like a leopard or a panther's face, like a you know a big cat's face. Sorry, I just had an itch in my ear. That required me moving my headphones. Yeti marketing. There's no door. Oh, what's that? Okay, they're, they're plants looking for a 3D view going. Good morning, Adam. Morning. I won't say it again, but Yeti Marketing. <laughs> 303. Hello, co-workers. Uh-huh. Adam, can you come to my office? I need to talk to you. Okay, door 301. Okay, everyone's eyes in this game is just whacked. This project you've been working on for about two months now, huh? It must be finished tomorrow morning, huh? You'll remember that, Adam, eh? Don't... You didn't forget it, eh? Don't know how to say that, eh, word. Tomorrow morning, yes, of course, I remember. Great, then go and work, and do not fail me. <laughs> okay, it's 10.12 a.m. in the morning. This must be Tuesday, Monday morning, actually, isn't it? You remember that, Adam? <laughs> Asshole. Okay, I can handle it as long as I don't get distracted by anything. Oh. Adam, everyone's gone home. Finish up, eh? I'm nearly done. I mean, I need a little more time here. But I'm definitely finished this project by morning. <laughs> don't worry. I don't worry. Goodbye, Adam. Okay, 6.45. And now it's it's 6.56 and he's calling. Baby, I got stuck at work. Yes, I'm very sorry about that. I'll try to come come in two or three hours. Okay, now it's 9.37. Oh. Uh, 11.46. Okay, I need a break. Maybe a news will help me take my mind off things. Okay, so, okay, we can... Oh, we're blinking. Click on the news. Okay, we're not going to be able to read this because it's blinking. Protest in Petersburg. Protest took place in Petersburg, held protest action last weekend. The participants demonstrated against the violence from 
uh, security forces. There's no precise da data on the number of participants at the moment. More than 1.3 thousand people uh, have been detained. Look closely at the people right next to you. Knowing the warning, warning suicide signs could be first step in helping a loved one. Follow this link to get a free consultation from our specialist. Can we follow the link? Oh, we can. I'm not interested. Okay, got an achievement just for that. Achievement unlocked. Social help. Try to go to... Okay, that worked. Oh, I like it. Smashing Down Fest takes place this Saturday. Uh, Grim Bone, uh, Bones and Roses. Crazy Ultra Goddess. I played a game called Ultra Goddess. And one and two. For, uh, both by Rattle League Games. Uh, Psychedelic uh, Fearmonium and our local stars, Sabbath Mercy, will rock the Smashdown Fest this Saturday. A shocking suicide of Emily Brown. Uh, Emily Brown, a vocalist of the local punk band, Savage Mercy, was found dead in her house. Uh, their body was discovered by Yannis F., another member of the band. I dropped in to Emily's house at 10, a 10, 10 p.m to discuss the upcoming performance, but God, she was dead. So obviously that's my wife that I'm playing as, Adam's wife, and I couldn't get to read the rest of it. I'm not that fast. Okay, so I, I when I was, this is, I won't pause it up just, yeah, we'll pause it just for a second. When I'm playing it just then, I thought my wife had already been dead and I'm just imagining her. I'm seeing her there, so I'm pretending she's still there in my head. Uh, but obviously not. Obviously, this is a lead up to her death. I spent, you know, all that time at work trying to do this stupid project. Um, and then she killed herself that night while I should have came home. But I didn't. Adam didn't, not me. It's not my fault. Okay, I don't even know what the time is now. It's like 33. <laughs> what was that? A dream. Got another achievement. Uh, from nightmare to nightmare. Wake up in a nightmare. Yes, that's right. Just a bad dream. And what's wrong with the computer? Why is this damn thing off? What's this stuff in the air? It's getting weird here. Apparently, I'm terribly overworked. I think I should go home. Fuck this project. Game saved. It's nice. Okay, do we go this way? Don't really know what way to go. It's creepy. It's creepy, guys. Now, nah, I, I just thought that my character was really depressed because my wife had already been dead. And that's why it looks like this. But obviously, she just died when I'm at work. Oh, I wasn't expecting to see anyone out here. Yes, I'm just working late. I even fell asleep at my desk while I decided to take a break and read the news. Only the news was strange. It's like it wasn't real. And there was a disgusting dream. Listen, Walter. Yes, Walter, excuse me. Don't you notice anything strange around here? Like what? To tell you the truth, I don't know how to say it. Things have certainly changed around here. No, no, it's not. It all looks the same. You must be tired. Nothing bad happened here. Absolutely nothing. You should go home to Emily and rest. She's probably waiting for you. Yes, Walter, you're right. Wait. How do you know her name? Go home, Adam. Emily is waiting for you. Do you remember? Here, take the key. Do I get a key? Okay, key. Got the key. Janitor's key. An ordinary key received from a strange janitor. It probably opens some kind of emergency exit in the western part of the office. Probably doesn't know. Uh, west is. Is this going this way? Okay, come. So we gotta go west. Like they said. Okay, there's no run button. I'm pressing a whole heap of buttons. Just testing the buttons. Uh, you can use the D-pad or you can use the stick. The joystick. Uh, so what's it called? L3, I think it's called. I just call it the stick. Grab hold of the stick, baby. And control me. Okay, so the time's still bleeding and screwed up. Hold up, hold up. Go back. Go back. It, it sits, I think. I definitely over ex uh, exented, extended myself at my hallucinating dark. Uh, I got an achievement said weird time. Find out the time. Actually, let's go back to our desk for a second. See if I can get another achievement here. For some reason, the computer is turned off and it doesn't turn on. There is no sense in work now. Okay. 
So we're just clicking everything that says the A comes to. Oh man, it's creepy. Genitor key used. Denial. Okay, so I don't know if she's been dead all this time. I still don't know. Or if she's dead, she killed herself while I was at work just then. Emily. Emily is often depressed, but they're completely normal for people like her. For sensitive people who notice all the negative aspects of life. I should return to her as soon as possible. I should get out of this office, get to the car, grab some wine, and along the way, and spend the rest of the day with her. I hope it was just a nightmare. Okay, so I'm, I'm guessing she's dead. She killed herself while I was at work. That's what I'm guessing. Okay, can't go that way. So we're in the closet right now, because if this is a janitor's closet, then man, open your eyes. I'm creeping out. It's like a Freddy Krueger movie. What does it mean? I don't remember such poster in our office. Oh, crap. Oh, oh. Oh, someone's face. That's Emily's face. Run. Run. Accept the truth. Achievement unlocked. Look at the whole chips. Uh, whole chips. Walking, walking something. Walk a hundred steps. <laughs> um, what was I saying? I don't, I can't remember. Truth? What truth? It doesn't matter what I was going to say. Oh, okay. So that's her face. She's creepy. I can't run. Don't deny. What the hell is that? And what's your face come? Creepy. Oh, knife. Oh, it's, it's a Michael Myers knife. I was going to say Jason's knife, but what's Jason have? I think he has a knife too, doesn't he? He's just got a whole heap of weapons. Pipes, knives. He'll kill you with his mask. I, I, want you to know, I want you to know. If you see anything strange here, right behind my back somewhere else, just don't mind it, Adam. You're just tired, that's all. Yeah, it's a creepy game, eh? Oh! Emily? Emily, baby? What are you doing here? Is... Is that really you? Oh, crap, she just ran. Emily? Damn, maybe I offended her somehow. Hell. I can't run though, so there's no way I'm catching up to her. Nor do I actually want to catch up to her, because it's freaky. It's getting redder. What a great game. I'm loving this game. Like, when I first started streaming for Rattleica Games, when I first started streaming it, I did... A couple of horror games like Distraint and Distraint 1 and 2. And they're all creepy as well. If you never played those games, play them back to back. Um, I love Rattalicky Games horror games. They are absolutely cool. Like, obviously, they don't make it. They publish them from consoles. But for some reason, they, they got me into indie horror. I absolutely love indie horror. They do it well. And I know that you can get, like, Resident Evil... And stuff like that but it's totally different totally different horror indie horror like games like this are spooky absolute spooky guys doesn't need to have flash graphics and 3d art and stuff like that it just needs to have atmospheric in a great storyline emily oh she disappeared oh they almost killed me i <laughs> could have been with her damn lights if this one falls in my head Baby, are you all right? Now, oh, I haven't fell. What if I stay there? I wonder if it hit me in the head. I'm, I'm, I want to know. I, I want to know. What do you reckon, guys? You reckon we should play it out? I need to know. Oh, she's got a knife. Okay, no, it doesn't do anything to me. I had to find out. Or maybe get a achievement after it. Achievement: light falls on head. Something like that. They got a great soundtrack in the background. Like, it's creepy. It's like a boiler room. Freddy Krueger's gonna pop out and slice me. The 
crap load stick staircase. Isn't it? How long does this staircase go for? It's getting dark. It's like I'm walking to hell. Feels like it's spanning out now. Yeah, it is spanning out a bit. It's getting really dark though. Soon away about see myself. <laughs> oh no. If something pops out right now, I'm going to scare my pants. Yeah, scare my pants. Oh no, I can, it's getting lighter. Kind of. Nah, uh, kind of keeping the same. I can kind of see myself. I've got a bad reflection on the screen at the moment, so I'm just going to move my head so I can see it. Yeah, I can see it good now. Hey, cowboy. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Playing a game today by the amazing people at Rattlick Games called Acceptance. Indie horror at its best. It's a good game. How you doing? How you doing, my friend? Once again, thank you for popping by. I appreciate you. Uh, Cowboy says, has your Series S dashboard uploaded yet? I turned on uh, Lay's Series, X, Series S two days ago, I think it was. Um, and I had an update. No, a little notification saying, I'm um, sorry, guys, I'll just, I'll just pause it up. Had a um, little notification say, get ready for your new dashboard coming soon. So that was the last time I turned it on. So I don't know if it has updated yet. Has yours? Uh, well, I stopped playing uh, Baldur's Gate 3 for this. You didn't have to stop. You know, you could do two things at once. You could play and have me on your phone or something like that. That's what I tend to do. You know, multitasking. Have you got the, have you got the little notification? Because I got the notification saying, as I just said, uh, your new dashboard. Get ready. Your new dashboard's coming. Something like that. And then I turned it off and then it was fine. I updated my controller though, or Lay's controller. So she had um she had an update for her controller. I like to be all in, baby. Balls deep. Uh okay, says, nah, nothing like that. It's strange how your Xbox One got it, then the Series S got it, but the Series S hasn't had the new update for the dashboard. Like my Xbox Series S X has, but my my daughter's S hasn't. It's weird, man. They're the same thing. Emily, you know what I mean? It's also, all it is is a dashboard. It's nothing, nothing else. <laughs> creepy, creepy. Oh, she's she white naked? Why are you naked? She is naked. Uh, Cowboy says, my ex, yeah, he said his one ex had it for ages. That's weird, eh? I can understand doing a one ex differently to the Series S and Series X. But the Series S and X are basically almost the same, which one's more powerful. Oh, she's got a knife. You want me to follow you? Yeah, oh yes, baby. Cool soundtrack in the background. It's really meated up, hasn't it? Meated up, not beat it up, meated up. It's nice and meaty. Is that is that blood? Oh. Oh, did something happen to you? Oh God, I'm coming. Cowboy says sexy time. <laughs> it's it's far from that type of game, Cowboy. It's about uh, depression and suicide, this game, which is um, kind of depressing in itself, isn't it? But it's a good game. It's creepy. It's a good game, though. Bolt cutter. The things look like a serious weapon. Uh, this would be a video game. I would attack the block. I uh, got an achievement for that. And the achievement was find a weapon. Uh, this The guy looks strung out. Yeah, well, I'm trying to figure out, Cowboy, if, if his wife's already dead and he's imagining her still alive and then he's trying to come into it because we're playing a, part, a chapter now called, kind of like a chapter called Denial. So I'm kind of I'm having this thing that he's denying that his wife is actually dead, but she's she is dead. So he's pretending she's still alive. He's denying she's deny he's denying it happened, and pretending she's still alive. She's still having conversations with her and stuff like that. Um, or or that I've spent my time at work, and now she died while I was at work. So I'm trying to figure it out, but I think I'm now I'm leaning towards the first the first thing I said that. She's been dead for a while now, and he's still in denial about it. That's what I'm thinking now. I'm going back and forwards. Okay, so we've got the bolt cutters. 
Um, something from the bottom says 10 out of 10. Well, that's my rating, baby. And I'll tell you what, this game at the moment is not far off a big 10 out of 10. Okay, so we've got B for block, A for attack. B for block, A for attack. B for block, A for attack. Okay, so we got we might have to fight monsters and stuff. This could be uh this could be bad. Okay, so obviously the 10 out of 10 is my health. Uh, I didn't expect this type of game. Now it's raining blood. It's raining blood. Hallelujah, it's raining blood. Freddy Krueger, baby. Okay, what the hell is this? Hey, are you alright, bud? Oh no, he's a monster. He looks like he's got a pair of sunglasses on. Okay. Oh, fuck! Fuck! He swings that like a wiggle does. Okay, he's dead. That took a while. Okay, got an achievement for that straight off the bat. Face your demons. Kill, kill your first enemy. Block. Oh, we still can smack him. <laughs> I didn't mean to, and I still did it. Ah, oh, it's cool. I hope there's health packs. If I've got health, then there should be health packs. They should, shouldn't they? I think so. I'm oh, it's another one. And he's dead. <laughs> I love it. Bolt cutters. I like bolt cutters for cutting, you know, cutting bolts and chains and stuff like that. Not. Well, they could all be used for smashing evil monsters with sunglasses. It looks like the guy, it looks like Bono but from U2, where his sun is on. Let's pause it up. Ah, uh, Sniper! Thank you for the raid, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome to the stream, guys. Playing a game by my sponsors, Rattle Like a Game, called Acceptance. It's about suicide and death and denial and depression. And it's, and it's creepy. It's a horror game. And once again, Sniper, I thank you, my friend. I thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's give uh, let's give Sniper a bit of a shout out. Much appreciated, my friend. Thank you all for calling past and watching me. Oh, I'm at an air swing. Die! It's, it looks like he's got sunglasses on, doesn't he? Kenneth, thank you for calling past the raid. Um, and thank you for talking or shouting out little um, emotes. You feel free to talk about anything, guys. It's all raining. It's never. It's it's never raining. It's raining mobs. It's raining my channel today. Hey hey. <laughs> I made that up. As you can probably tell, it was horrible. I'll stop singing. Die. These guys just don't, don't stop coming, do they? Uh, Cowboy says, it's in the nightclub scene in Blade. Remember, oh, good one. Are they, aren't they making Blade 4? I, I had this, um, I don't know if I was dreaming this, or I read it somewhere that Wesley Snipes, good old Wesley Snipes, passion, you're 57, um, was going to make Blade. Well, thinking about, thinking or rumors about Blade 4 coming out, That'd be pretty cool. Oh, no, nah, they're just rebooting it. I hope he... Is he going to be in it? I guess he's not going to be in it. There'll be some other guy. Michael uh, Michael B. Jordan will be it, I reckon. <laughs> I don't know why. He just seems to be anything. Uh, these creatures. Or was it me? Some twisted alter ego of mine and freaky smile on his face. Is he, he's not in jail, though, is he still? I thought he got out of jail for that. <laughs> for not paying his taxes. Uh, what were they so happy about? There's some strange shit going on here. And they're smiling. Maybe everything is happening here is okay for them. Or do they just deny all this horror? Anyway, good thing I have the bolt cutter with me. I still haven't cut anything with the bolt cutters though. Which is kind of weird. Still got my health 10 out of 10. Oh, oh, what's that? Is that a dude I need to whack up the head? Yeah, it's, it's like a, it's like a jack-in-the-box clown kind of thing. Oh, I'm gonna kill him. He only took three hits. The other guys took four, I think. 
I just want to make sure he's dead. He came out of nowhere though, because it's dark, and he just he just popped his head out. And I, I'm too scared to keep walking. Oh, there's another one. They're all the same. Hold, hold, wait, if we stay still, it looks like they got knives all on these dudes. I think his nose is no. Oh no, he's trying to cut me. He's Edward Scissorhands. Did you see that? I was just trying to check him out. He's trying to cut me. Yeah, he's got knives in his eyes, and then he had knives and Edward Scissorhands. That's what he. Oh no! Oh no again. <laughs> They're all the, the characters are all the same, yes, but it's still a brilliant game. I like it. Oh, here he comes. I'm yet to get hurt though. Oh, that guy could have been, instead of Edward Scissorhands, he could have been Baraka. Is it Baraka for Mortal Kombat? When he gets on his knees and starts doing that slicey dicey thing? Oh, another one. Well, they're not stopping today, are they? Okay, yeah, I think it's five. Is it five hits for those and three for the um, whatever they are? Edward, Edward, Bar we'll call him Edward Baraka. Bit of Edward Scissorhand Baraka. I think it's Baraka. Probably wrong, but that's how we're going with today. Yeah, so he's got knives in his eyes, knives or he's just covered in knives, and he's done. It's two. He sees trying to three. Oh no, he's going to take four. This one, four. That was a five. This one's four. Creepy soundtrack in the background. Yeah, no music, but just like a, like something you'd hear in a boiler room, eh? Here's Freddy, and he slices you. This is like a Freddy Krueger kind of thing, isn't it? Oh no! And then we've got. Oh, they were just double teaming me. It's like wrestling tag team style. Like, I'm gonna block. There's block, but I don't know what block's gonna do. I haven't used it yet. Like, I haven't really needed to use it. Oh, I just smacked something on the. I just smacked the ground that bled. Oh. Oh crap! He got me. He was a quick one. He was quick. I lost one point of health. Now I'm down to nine. Nine. That's one away from ten. Okay, we've got some music going. Oh, a reflection on the ground? Liking that. Hold it. I don't know what that did. Maybe he's been watching too many Thor movies. God of love. Game saved. I like how it says game saved. I like that. I don't need to go into saving. There's no save options. It just automatically saves when you get to a certain part. Oh! Okay, four. I, I think it just varies how many, like how many times you actually hit him with a good shot, maybe. Okay, my health's dead. Back, back up to ten. I don't want to get too close to these little dudes or slice the dices because they're good at okay this must take a little bit more they're good at killing you or maybe not maybe good at cutting you okay we're getting some uh oh we've got a new guy okay he looks like uh he's got a, he's got arms like a monkey oh he's quick though Okay, I killed him. I don't know what he was. It was a drugo looking. Uh, looks like a char. He didn't know what he looked like, man. He looked like a, he had monkey arms. That's what I'm telling you. Monkey arms. He was charged. Oh, he's another one. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Okay, got him. Got down to eight. Man, he just came out of nowhere. He was like Mike Tyson. Yeah, he kind of looked like my character. That's why I thought maybe I shouldn't attack him. And then I attacked him. Same to hell. But that second guy though, wow, he was fast. He was on a mission. He was going places, that fella. So I hit him. Okay, Bono's back, but he's facing the wrong way. I woke him up. You know this game needs? It needs a gun. Like a shotgun. Can't beat a shotgun, guys. You can't miss with a shotgun. 
Well, you can if you're if you're me, you can. In Resident Evil 4, point blank range with a shotgun, I shot the sky by accident. <laughs> I missed the dude right in front of me. Ah, oh, that was those days. I think it's on stream too, so if you want to look at my YouTube channel, you might be able to find it somewhere. I don't know where it is, but yeah, Resident Evil 4 on the Xbox. Not the not the remake, just the original on the um, Xbox. And yeah, I, I panic and shoot in the air. Right in front of a dude. <laughs> Everyone laughed at me. It was it was cool. Oh Adam. Look at what you've called Bolt Cutter, man. You are like a hero or some indie thriller. I'll ask you an indie sick question if you don't mind. And you do mind. Anyway, I don't give a shit. Do you enjoy killing these creatures? Do you like to feel the cold metal entering their flesh? The way their open wounds spew that bright, sexy red blood. Did you see the crying guy pierced with needles of suffering? It was needles, was it? I thought it was knives. Have you ever wondered what, uh, what wrong he did to you? What he did to you deserve your aggression? He feels fucking bad enough without you making it worse. And what about the smiling ones? Yeah, I know. It isn't very pleasant to see someone smile when their life is all free fall. But admit this. You never felt so confident before. And if you can solve any problem in your life, it was in the form of such monsters like the guys you just mercenary killed. Go fuck yourself, my friend. <laughs> the only monster in your life is yourself. Live with it. Accept yourself. Accept everything that happens. See you later, motherfucker. Okay, that was cool. That was cool. You know, he's got that kind of tang, a bit of uh, swearing going on. But he, the way he said it was, um, you don't really take offense to the way people come, sometimes people swear. It just comes out natural for him. Okay, it's, oh, oh, Needle Boy. He's, he's rising from the ground. So we're going to smack him on the head with our bolt cutter. Stay down there. Okay, there's another one coming up. Not getting him, just getting his brother here. Oh, there's another one. Okay, there's one crawling, I think. No, no, we're just going downstairs. Oh, okay, that's not why he's one that killed. See him flying. Okay, what do you reckon? We're going downstairs or we're just going down a ramp? I'm gonna say stairs. Oh, oh, what oh, that was back. Oh, there's two of them. Ah, two at once. Take that, buddy. Take that. What a creepy game, eh? This game rocks, man. If you were into some indie horror game, like a thriller, man, acceptance all the way. Once again, this stream is proudly sponsored by and supplied by Radlicker Games. RadlickerGames.com check them out without them this stream would not be happening today so big shout out to them i want to thank everyone for calling past my twitch channel live right now thank you thank you thank you well once again if you couldn't make it live today and you're watching this right now on my youtube channel hey thank you for watching my friend much appreciate oh bueno only three times it's random it's like a it's like a ramp isn't it like a hill. It's like I'm walking up a hill. Now down the hill. Jack and Jill went up the hill. Fetched to smash some dudes with bolt cutters. Jill fell down and broke a crown. And Jack, he just killed the rest of the monsters. Should have said Adam. Adam. Not Jack. Kind of swinging and not hitting anyone at the moment. You're dead. Very dark game though. <laughs> it's like it's you know, all you see is your character. What? Okay, let's have a, let's have a bet. If you're watching me live right now, what monster do you reckon we should see next? So we've got Bono, which is the like the the fire one, and then we've got the needle one, and then we've got like the um, I'm gonna call we'll call them the Drago ones. 
and they kind of look like the, my character. So I'm, I'm going to go with a neater one. I reckon we, the next one we see is a neater one. What do you reckon, guys? If you're watching me live right now, just type in the chat right now. Needle. You can always say Needle, Bono, or Drago. Come on, Needle. Or no one at all, because it's the end of the stage. <laughs> okay, we're back here. Is it going to be a game saved, or... Okay, I'm not controlling this. This is good. Oh! Oh, well, this guy again. Oh, Adam. You're such an idiot. Look at yourself, puffing, pushing, trying not to die. Fighting against yourself. But you always knew it was pointless. Your struggle, all your efforts, it doesn't make any sense. It would be easier just to give up. You would definitely break down. Not now, but a bit later. In an hour, tomorrow, in a week, in half a year. What's the difference? Your break... I'm sure as shit. I know you well enough, you miserable jerk. Okay. You're basically fighting yourself and running from the truth right now, aren't you? So let me help you in the name of long-standing friendship. Run and fight, moron. Run and fight. I don't even know. Who is this dude? Is he the janitor? Okay, so we're gonna run. But I don't know what the run button is. Maybe we, we finally figured out what the run button is. Okay, we're running. I'm not even controlling. He's just running. What am I supposed to do? Okay, press A when it tells me to press A. B. X. Okay, it's random. B. A. Okay. X, B, A. Oh, crap. Ha, ha, ha. Get it, motherfucker. Oh my god, your health's an A. How was I supposed to do that? Oh man, X. No, it's not, it's B. A. So it's B or A. B or A. B is block. A. B for block. A, Y, B, X, B, Y. Ha 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 ha. You bitch. Man, I can't believe I did that. That was intense. I need my health to be generated again. Oh, it's nerve-wracking as hell. <laughs> oh, no, I did press A. Maybe I just pressed both at the same time. B, X, B, Y, Y, A. Oh, I got it again. Stop switching. Stop twitching on Twitch, baby. Three health, three health. Oh, I'm so dead. Run, run, you won't succeed anyway. Oh man, this game's gonna stop. I can't keep doing this, I'm nervous as F. The three health is not gonna help me, eh? <laughs> stop resisting and your life will instantly become easier. Oh, thank God that's finished. You can't escape the reality, you idiots. I uh, got an achievement. Run away from Black Adam. Are you okay, Black Adam? <laughs> it's the rock. So it is myself. But, uh, let's pause it up. It is myself, but just the evil version of myself. Uh, Cowboy's laughing at me. I can't believe you made it. Cowboy, at the start, I had no idea what I was doing. I copped a lot of health. But the hardest thing about it was, is that sequence. Because, you know how you just... You know where the buttons are, but you get nervous and then you just completely press the wrong button. And there were so many of them. But I can't believe I made it on the first attempt too, number one. And my health's on three, so... We're almost dead. We need some spray like Resident Evil style. But the door is locked from the other side. Man, no one's dropping any health. I thought with the game saved, you got your health back. 
That was that was intense though. That was intense, guys. I liked it though. I did like it. <laughs> but wow! Oh, crap! Tina, two health! Crap! Oh, I'm almost dead. Okay, one health. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> he came out of nowhere like a crazy monkey. So I'm guessing all these characters that we're seeing are me. Just different versions of me. Needle me, Botto me, Crazy Drogo me, and then there's Black Adam. The Rock, Dwayne Johnson. Air swinging it. I'll let you know when you air swing because it hits the damn ground. Oh, yes. oh, I won't do it now. Hear it? That's cool. I like that. Little, little touches like that in games like this. I know it's not a big thing, but when you hit the ground with the bolt cutters, it makes a little bit of ding. It's cool. It's cool. It's getting dark again, guys. Oh. And the way they've done it, A. A for attack and B for block. Get it? A. A for attack. B for block. <laughs> Small things amuse me, guys. I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for it, cowboy. One health. One health. How far could I get without... I haven't seen any health to pick up, so I don't know how to get health. But I wasn't at 8 before, and then somehow I went back to 10. Maybe I'll go back to 10 after I get past this little stage. No, it's still a 1. What's that? Okay, so that's how you get your health back. By hitting the ground. <laughs> I was hitting the ground before. Okay, that's cool, but it only happens every now and then. What's that? Man, this game is just me. Oh, okay, it's an elevator and it's just pure dark. Everything that happens. Is this real? This beautiful feeling with metal collides with their flesh. It's completely real and very pleasant. Okay, so we've got some red going on. Going. Where do we go? Going this way? Okay, so where do I go? Do I smash this wall? Bolt cutter used. Okay, so we just cut it. Finally, we get to use the bolt cutters for the actual, what they're actually used for. Okay, it's, it's pitch dark now. Pitch black, I should say, with Vin Diesel. Remember that? That was that movie was made here in Australia. Oh, you hit him once, and then they run for you. Oh crap! He ran straight past me. Oh, oh, okay. I can't see myself. There's a pole in the way. Fuck's he gone? Okay, this is shit now. Okay, so my health is down to six. And I... I can't even see this fella. Man, he's creeping from... I just gotta keep going, I think. Oh no, I've gotta kill him. Okay, three health. I'm trying to swing before it gets to me. Now. Okay, I got him though. I got him. Got him there. Just timing. I don't know where he's going to... Now. Okay, got me. Shit. Oh, I came from behind me, the dirty bugger. Game over. Press the button to try again. Let's try that again. That's freaky. Because this dude just... Yeah, he's just... Wow. Wow. <laughs> he just comes from nowhere. He's like a boss fight. Where is he? These poles suck too because you walk at the next minute. They block your view. There he is. Okay, so he's going to come from this side now. 
Oh, fucker. Got ya. Got ya. Now he's coming from this side. Okay. Too quick from that time. Bolt cutter's way a heavy mount. Oh, man. Oh, man. I was almost timing that one. I suck. Did I get him and he got me? I think I got him and he got me. I'm just gonna keep pressing it. Okay, it's not it's not working. I'm going twice then. It's my best bet. It's just to keep doing this. Okay, down to two. Down to one. Okay, so I'm... Is he gonna fucking die? Okay, bloody hell. How many times do you have to hit this fella? Wow. It's it's nerve-wracking as well. I think you probably have to hit him ten times. <laughs> I hit him whack. I think my best bet is just to hit... Smash in the, um, the hit button. That way... You know, I'm not trying to time it because it's hard to see when he rocks up and he's quick. He's a quick little fella. He's like a Jack Russell. Little terrier. Ooh, got you twice with you. Oh, three times, baby. Oh, where's he gone? Four times. I haven't been hit once. I'm going four times. Oh, five times. Six times. I'm gonna roll. Okay, got me once. Now it's his turn, I reckon. Ah ha ha! Okay, I think it's seven times now I got him. Eight times? This, this plan's worked. Nine times? Or only ten times? Come on, it has to be ten times, doesn't it? Ten. Eleven. He doesn't want to die. Okay, got me. He got me. Oh, he's dead. Okay, he got me, but I got him. I think it was 12 times I hit him. Wow, intense. Tense, my friends. Hope we save soon. Yeah, it's saved. It's saved. Where am I? And where is my bolt cutter? Fuck. And on that note, guys, it's time to end the stream. Acceptance. Proudly supported and sponsored by the amazing people at Radlicker Games. Radlickergames.com. Check them out. Let's check out the credits once more. Ruzo Mono, the developer. Thank you for the brilliant game. Now, what do we think about the game? Acceptance, guys. Storyline, um, depression, suicide, denial, acceptance, all in one. It's great, great storyline. Your wife's killed herself and you're in denial of it. And then you've got to learn, go through the processes of grieving it, stuff like that. Really, really cool storyline. Excellent, I should say. Visualization, brilliant. Love the way the game looks. This is my personal opinion, Chris. Love the way the game looks. Indie horror at its best. Dark, red, crazy like little monster things. It's just creepy. It gives me uh, goosebumps and chills just, just looking at the game. Soundtrack. Um, it hasn't got a massive music soundtrack, got atmospheric sound and a bit of just music in the background, just like creepy boiler room Freddy Krueger music, uh, like the old 80s style horror movies. Um, can't get any better than that. Nice soundtrack. Gameplay wise, I played today in the Xbox Series X. No glitches, no bugs at all that I encountered. Uh, pretty simple. A for attack, B for block. There's got some uh, quick time events where you got to press all the buttons. As you can see, uh, monsters are easy to kill by hitting your bolt cutters against their heads. You can block their attacks, but I didn't bother about that. Um, and moving is with the joystick or the stick. So, nothing more to say really, guys. Acceptance out of 10, 10, 10 out of 10. Why, why not? It's a great game. Go pick it up right now for the Nintendo Switch, PS4, PS5, Xbox One, Xbox Series S, and X. Uh, Cowboy says, ask and you shall receive. Damn right, the game is brilliant, guys. Absolute brilliant. If you're into horror games, and especially indie, indie horror games, the games, I think the game's under a tenner. So you don't have to, here in Australia, I think it's under 10 bucks on sale, probably right now. Go and pick it up, guys. 
Brilliant game. Brilliant. Uh, as I said, I'd like to thank everyone for calling past the live stream today. Um, Jericho, Xbox Cowboy, uh, Sniper, thank you for the raid, my friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Everyone else that called past the stream, uh, thank you. Thank you for watching me. If you can't, if you didn't call past the live stream today because you couldn't make it, or you just didn't want to call past, but you decided to watch this back on my YouTube channel instead, I want to say thank you for watching. You mean the world to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Guys, it's not, it's not, uh, not necessary. It's never asked for, but if you want to follow my channels and you're crazy enough to do so, then I want to thank you in advance. Make sure you take care of yourselves and ones you love. Don't forget to feed your pets. Say hi to your dog for me. And remember, you're perfect just the way you are. Unless you want to change, then change. Just be you, do, and you'll be fine. Also, guys, if you're suffering depression or any suicidal thoughts, please go see some help. Talk to a friend or just talk to anyone. Um, yeah, it's, it's not a good thing, but yeah, a lot of people suffer from it. So it's not, don't be too afraid to get some help or too afraid to talk to someone. Until next time, guys, it's been Radalika Games uh, presents Acceptance. Thank you for watching and bye for now. Ta-ta.